We did talk about religious freedom, and I will say that the prime minister was incredible on what he told me. He wants people to have religious freedom, and very strongly. And he said that in India, India they have uh, they have worked very hard to have great and open religious freedom. And if you look back and look at what's going on relative to other places, especially, but they have really worked hard on religious freedom. I, I asked that question in front of a very large group of people today, and he talked about it. We talked about it for a long time. And uh, I really believe that's what he wants. But as someone well, we who... did discuss that, and we discussed that, and specifically Muslims, and we also discussed Christians. But someone and who... we, I had, a, I had a very powerful answer from the prime minister. We talked about religious liberty for a long period of time in front of a lot of people, and I had a very, very powerful answer. And as far as Muslims are concerned, as he told me, I guess they have 200, 200 million Muslims in India. And a fairly short while ago, they had 14 million. And he said that uh, they're very, working very closely with but, the but Muslim you, community. But so you yourself have been criticized for policies that have discriminated against Muslims, like the travel ban. There's also been a rise in well, here over the I, last couple of years yeah, in the US. Yeah. So are you in a position? to talk to him about those subjects. Yeah, I won the travel ban, as you probably know. A lot of people said I lost it. No, I won the travel ban. And we use the travel ban where we think there's, not based on religion, but where we think there's going to be trouble, where we're looking at certain countries. As you know, we added a few countries onto it. But we won the travel ban, and we won it in the Supreme Court. So the travel ban is uh, not a thing against Muslims. It's a thing against areas where we don't want people coming into our country that are going to mm -hmm. cause problems, cause harm, cause death, hurt our people. And I feel very strongly about that. Okay. So as far as the individual attack, I heard about it, but I didn't discuss that with him. That's uh, up to India. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, I don't want to discuss that. I want to leave that to India and hopefully they're going to make the right decision for the people. That's really up to India. Uh, yeah, go mean? ahead, please, please. We talked a lot about Pakistan. I have a very good relationship with Prime Minister Khan, very good. Uh, we talked about it today at length, actually, and Prime Minister Modi. And it's no question it's a problem, but it's a problem they have, they're working on it. it India is, you know, it's a brave nation too. There's no pullback from India. And we just hope, and I said, I'll help, I'll do whatever I have to do if I can do that because my relationship with both gentlemen is so good. Uh, but there has been difficulty in Pakistan and we're seeing what we can do about it. Anything I can do to mediate, anything I can do to help, I would do. They're working on Kashmir. Kashmir has been a thorn in a lot of people's sides for a long time. And there are two sides to every story, but they've been working on that very hard. We discussed it at great length, terrorism. And uh, I think we have some very good ideas. He's very, very strongly against terrorism. I'll tell you, Prime Minister Modi is a very, uh, he's a very uh, religious man, as you know. He's a very calm man, but he's actually a very, very strong person. Very tough, actually. When I've seen him in action, and uh, he's got that foremost in his mind: terrorism. He'll take care of it. I didn't say that. I didn't say anything about that. I just said Kashmir, obviously, there's a big problem between Pakistan and India. And I think they're going to work out their problem. But I will say they've been doing it for a long time. That, okay, my question is something different at the moment. Time. 